Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, as, it, as you can tell, I'm very happy. So, I uh, just finished a uh, Hamon. Hamon now has four. Now, I think that's probably been probably one of the best games of the season so far. A full 90 minutes we started, we started strong right from kickoff. Now, the back four, a uh, McGinn, Portrius, Hanlon, sorry, the back three. McGinn, Portrius, Portrius. Hanlon and Stevenson, yeah, yeah. So I mean, we so honestly we anything that we basically touched to the majority. Well, obviously we scored the four and vital goals, but we could have had more. So, within 10 minutes into the game, uh, Boyle scores from the spot. Then, uh, not long after, uh, Christian Dodge scores. And then, Paul McGinn scores. I mean... And then obviously nice big get says go I mean we now hopefully obviously we've got a game again on Tuesday against Alwa and the quarter final we did the bet Fred Cup but from what Jack Ross has installed into Hibs it's brilliant because not only, yeah, fair enough, we're second for, what, 24 hours. But I think we've, we've done well this season, obviously. Um, it's obviously, you know, I honestly can't. I honestly can't doubt any player from that performance today. Louis always, as always, gives his 110%. And then Paul McGinn, Paul, can oh, I mean, I mean, it's, we we started very well and I think we've not seen us when we when we score we haven't seen them build on that one goal leader. But today once we scored it it was like we were I generally think that game was going on five or six now. I mean, but like, Hibs, I think I've said it before, but Hibs have got very difficult month. Um, so we've got Alloa on Tuesday, then we've got Dundee United on Saturday game. I mean, we could potentially get so obviously we've got realistically we could this is probably going to be Hibs's could potentially be best season. Um, obviously we should easily now get third. 
third spot. I mean, there's no doubt in that. Especially with Aberdeen slipping up a few times. Now it's just us that we need to kick on from tonight's before, from today's performance. Carry that into Tuesday's before, uh, Tuesday game. Then into the Dundee night game and, you know, the teams around us, um, that just, you know, they'll take care of it. So, as long as we're winning and not dropping points, we should be good. And it also helps when there's no, like, winter break this year, which... That also helps. Hopefully next year, hopefully we, we get some fans back into to the, the stadium, obviously. It's, obviously, I'm president time at the moment, but we can't ask any more than what we saw today. I mean... It was good to see a few young boys getting um coming on and obviously Stephen McGinn came on as on as well but we're, we're second for twenty four hours at least. I mean if Celtic drop points, um I think they'll go second due to goal difference. But Hopefully, now touch with it might not happen, but touch with Celtic get beat and Hibs to stay second for <laughs> at least a week. But look, thank you all so much for the support. I'll leave the video here. But if you have enjoyed my content, please subscribe, please turn on your notification, please like the video, and please. Comment down below. <laughs> but thank you all. Good night.